Hello, this is Michael Manna. I want to welcome you to episode two in estate planning and elder law. As you recall, I am the senior executive in the law firm Michael A. Manna and Associates. We are an elder law and estate planning law firm located in Ridgewood, New Jersey, and in Suffern, New York. Uh, I teach this material to other lawyers, I teach it to certified public accountants, I teach it to social workers, and if you'd like to get a full list of my credentials, please review episode one, or you can go to our website, which is www.law, L-A-W, four, the number four for seniors, and uh, .com, and you can get a complete breakdown of uh, our qualifications and the rest of the people in my firm. Again, that's www.law, the number four, seniors.com. Anyway, in this episode, I want to discuss the essential documents everyone should have. There are three pieces of paper we all should have. Once you're 18, in both New York and New Jersey, you're an adult, and when you reach that age, you should have these documents. The first one is a will. Now, I must have three people a week come in and they say they don't want a will, they want a revocable living trust. And when I asked them why, they said that it might save taxes and or uh, avoid probate. Well, the first thing I want to tell you is that a revocable living trust will not save you one penny in taxes that you cannot save with a well-drawn will. So you do not need a revocable living trust to save taxes. Uh, the other point about a revocable living trust is that it avoids probate. Now I will tell you, in New Jersey, we have informal probate. It is a trivial thing. All you need to probate a will in New Jersey is the original will. You need a certified copy of the death certificate. And you go to the surrogate's office, which is in the county seat where the person died a resident. So if you were in Bergen County, New Jersey, you would go to the Bergen County Courthouse in Hackensack to the surrogate's office, which is on the second floor of the courthouse. You present them with the will. You present them with a certified copy of the death certificate. And you pay their fee, usually under $200, usually well under $200. And they then issue a piece of paper called Letters Testamentary. Uh, this is the official document that says you're the executor of the estate and with this document you can take care of the affairs of the deceased. Your job is to final, uh, file the deceased's final income tax return, pay all their bills, distribute their assets in accordance with the terms of the will, and if their estate is large enough, and we will talk about this in future episodes, uh, to pay any estate taxes that are due. And then with what's left, to pay it out to the uh, heirs as named under the will. That's all probate is. Some people will pay as much as $3,500 for a revocable living trust, and in New Jersey, all it does is save you a trip to Hackensack and $200. It makes absolutely no sense in my mind. I think the problem is most New Jerseyites uh, uh, winter in Florida, and I can tell you that in Florida, probate is very complex. It's kind of nightmarish, and it's very fashionable in Florida to have a revocable living trust to avoid probate. But it is not necessary in New Jersey. I will tell you in New York, probate is a little more complex than it is in New Jersey. And a revocable living trust might make sense in New York, but certainly it does not in New Jersey. Now, once you have a will, you can do wonderful things with that will. Uh, this lecture is going a little too far right now, so we will continue in the next episode on wills. In the meantime, if you'd like to call my office, the number is 201-447-2800. That's 201-447-2800. And you can make an appointment for a free initial consultation. It is our office policy that the first visit is on the house. So if, if you can get here at Ridgewood, I would be happy to see you for the first visit for free. That's Ridgewood, New Jersey. And again, that number is 201-447-2800. And we will continue in episode three about what you can do with wills. Thank you very much.